Good health, a good temperament, and a desire to work are traits all of us would like to have. For service dogs, these traits are necessary. Goodwill Assistance Dog Academy is dedicated to training and placing service dogs. News Channel 9's Beth Newhoff tells us about the special bonds that can develop. Meet Mason Plot, a typical 13-year-old that loves the outdoors more than schoolwork. But Mason's days are anything but typical. He was a healthy, active, very mischievous toddler when his life changed. 20 months old, he was in a car accident with his great-grandmother and his older brother. And um, unfortunately, she didn't make it and he was rendered paralyzed. He had a spinal cord injury, C5, C6, and uh, had a C2 fracture. Paralyzed from the chest down for the past 11 years, Mason finally has a wheelchair with power assist that moves when he touches the wheel. It took forever to get. It was expensive. Going to school has always been a challenge. He dreams of a day he can be more independent with someone to help him if mom's not there. Pick stuff off the floor or open the doors that I can't do. Mason is hoping to one day receive a Goodwill service dog. 25 people applied for the three dogs available this year. We start with an eight-week-old puppy. They receive two years of training. They learn over 90 different commands. And when they complete their testing and they meet the requirements to graduate as a service dog, then they're matched with someone on our waiting list. Training is a costly process at $25,000 per dog. It costs nothing for those who are lucky enough to be matched. A priceless partnering of personalities. It's not just about finding a dog for a person with a disability on our waiting list, it's finding the right dog. Okay, lap. Dress, that's it, that's it, yes, good boy, excellent. That perfect match was found this year for Mason. I was there as he met his new partner and friend. So I'm so proud to say for the very first time ever and present Danny Plot. <laughs> <laughs> Surprise turning into emotion. The bonding starts right away. But there's still a lot of training for these two this summer. And by fall, Mason and Danny Plott will attend eighth grade together at Heritage Middle School. Beth Newhoff, News Channel 9. <laughs> What a sweet dog and a sweet guy. Two others received service dogs this week. Rich Burns and Bliss Welch will also begin their training this summer. For more information on the Goodwill Assistance Dog Program, just visit newschannel9.com and click on this story. Yet another reason dogs are awesome. I know. Yeah.